Worcester riding a four-game win streak into Bud Plank Field, fresh off an 8-5 win over Ashland the previous night. And some tough pitching conditions, blowing their way through the playing surface early on, creating quite a challenge for Arrow starter Tyler Krosky. The wins were really getting to me, and you know I was just trying to go out there and throw strikes, and eventually started picking up strikes. It's a big factor. Um, the wind's really getting your eyes and making my eyes water. Um, and it has an effect, but you still need to go out there and throw strikes and get the job done. Krosky would load up the bases in the top half of the second, giving up this RBI single to Christian Scout to put the Generals out in front one zip. Tyler would eventually pitch his way out of the jam, though. Then the floodgates would burst absolutely wide open for the Ashland offense, hanging some major crooked numbers on the home scoreboard for three consecutive innings. Lots of runs there, second, third, and fourth inning. What, what do you think collectively played into that for the team? I think we had a lot of energy and just, we kept playing off of each other, just kept the ball rolling and having. <laughs> one guy hits a double and the next guy hits a line drive, RBI, and just, just keeps piling on top of each other. And energy builds on energy and it's just, it just goes well together. You know, you can't ask for that every night, but, but we'll take it when it comes. Uh, it makes, makes the game a lot easier. You put the ball in play, good things happen, and and we swung the bats well tonight. That would be a bit of an understatement. 18 hits for the Arrows in this shortened contest would eventually add up to 20 runs for the game. Notching four in the second, five more in the third, then Ashland lit up the scoreboard for 11 in the fourth, rocking the Generals to claim their first league win of the season, 20 to three in just four and a half innings. I feel like a game like today is maybe a statement win, uh, getting a beat down over Worcester like this? Yeah, it's a really big statement win, especially uh, coming off of a loss yesterday and coming back and really using our bats and really telling everybody uh, in the league that we're here. This is a team that feel like they have big expectations for the year? Uh, I mean, we're, we're a pretty young team, but I know each guy on this team is really competitive and I mean, we all want to get wins. And I think we do have some big expectations despite how young we are. Bats are really starting to come along, pitching starting to come along, fielding starting to come along. So everything's going together, every piece of the puzzle, and we're just getting better for every game. For the OH Report, powered by BS Media. My name's Brian Skaronski.